Hey guys, today I am going to be talking about the new Marc Jacobs Traveler Tote in the small size. As you can see, I just got it here. <laughs> so I just got this last week. Yeah, I don't know. I, I have been obsessed with book totes and tote bags in general recently. I kind of briefly mentioned this in my recent review. I did a comparison reviewing all the those structured book totes. At the end, I, I mentioned how I kept seeing this bag pop up and it was in the large size in the beige, which is I think what I was eyeing at first. And I mean, it's not com completely off the table, but then I saw the small size and, and it's in this really pretty blue color. So I just was kind of hemming and hawing and whatever, I just got it. I got it because it has a crossbody strap. So on the front it says the tote bag. The actual style name is called the Traveler Tote by Marc Jacobs. And yeah, I, I don't know. I really like Marc Jacobs. It's kind of like an entry into designer, right? I mean, there was Marc Jacobs and then I think there was Marc by Marc Jacobs. And I had one of those tote bags when I was in college. It's kind of like a lower end. The prices of, of those are kind of comparable to maybe Coach and Tory Burch. Um, but yeah, I just think it's so cute. Okay, so here's the front. It says the tote bag. It says Marc Jacobs on the bottom in a lighter blue color. This is called Blue Shadow, by the way. And the back has their kind of signature Marc Jacobs decal stamp logo, uh, where it says the Marc Jacobs, the Marc Jacobs style tote bag, location NYC, year 1984. And I feel like this is literally me. I'm from New York City and, and year 1984 is my birth year. <laughs> So I was like, oh my gosh, this is my, this is my birth year bag anyway. But yeah, so I really wanted this because I, I have tons of huge bags, the YSL Rive Gauche tote, Louis Vuitton on the go GM. And then I have the Dior book tote in the Navy oblique. And this is also the large. I also have the small size, you know, they're all great, but what I really love are crossbody bags. And so this kind of straddles both worlds where it's a smaller tote bag. Uh, it also it has a zipper on the top and then it has this crossbody strap which is just oh, it's so great here's the small book tote the small dior book tote and then this is this small mark jacobs tote you can see it's um maybe about the same height maybe a little sh a, s a little shorter but it's not as wide either kind of hard to see with the straps but there it is lined up and then this is maybe there it is let's see maybe like couple inches maybe one and a half inch shorter first of all I love the color I love blue the canvas is it's this you know it's a it's just a canvas it's just a shopper's tote but it's a really nice um, really durable kind of a thick canvas and then it has this uh, zipper and this is a really heavy-duty <laughs> zipper that closes all the way at the top there's no pockets on the outside or anything which is fine it has, um, it's a silver hardware lobster clasp on the side there. Here's the inside. It has um, this really convenient, it has actually, yeah, a few pockets in here. So there's a zip pocket in here and then two slip pockets. Now, um, this is great because these pockets are really big. You know, a lot of times these bags have phone pockets and they're not even wide enough to fit, you know, modern day, um, smartphones like my LV Cabas Mezzo tote which is a tote bag from the early 2000s it has a cell phone pocket and that was when cell phone cell phones back then were like the razor phone remember those the Motorola razor they were so tiny and so it doesn't fit my you know an iPhone X max I always like to carry my cell phone and then I have this chart um, this portable charger and I've shown this before, but this is great because it has the plug right on the back and then it has multiple ports. So it has the lightning port and then the micro USB and then another, I don't even know what the other one is, but yeah, this is great. So this fits perfectly in here. It has a zip pocket and I'll show you the tag. So this is the tag on here. Um, it's 175, color is blue shadow. There's the tag. And then it comes with a little certificate, which I didn't even get this on my other on my older Marc Jacobs tote bags, but the body is 100% cotton. A little care booklet, care book, whatever. <laughs> so I'll do some mod shots. I probably wouldn't wear this tote bag with this uh, outfit. This is kind of like a lace romper, but just to show what it looks like here. So it fits on the side here. You can wear it over your shoulder. 
like that, and you can shorten it if you want. I'm five feet tall for reference. And this is it as a crossbody. So you can shorten it if you want. I, I like for I like to be able to reach into the bag, obviously, when I'm wearing it as a crossbody, so I have a little higher. But yeah, this way I can just reach in, grab my phone, um, zip it up. Oh, so cute. <laughs> When I have my kids, I don't have to worry about them spilling something on my Dior book tote or anything. You know, if they do it on this, it's fine. I, I probably will protect this with Scotch Guard. That's usually what I use to protect my canvas, like untreated canvas bags. So I'll probably do that just to make it a little more spill proof. But again, even if it does get dirty, you know, I wouldn't mind as much because it's, you know, it's it's a little more reasonably priced. So here it is with the other side showing. So it's a little more discreet if you didn't want that huge you know, the tote bag, Marc Jacobs logo showing. You can have this showing. So yeah, oh, so cute, I really like it. <laughs> Very casual, I love this color. They actually just released a bunch of new colors for the spring, summer. There was like a coral, there's a yellow, I think. I really like the blue. Another color I would consider getting is, there's a slate green that's kind of like a really nice neutral. I might consider getting the, the large beige one so that fits very comfortable and a lot of people have been commenting saying that they're also you know looking into that um, size bag but i really like this size too i think they're actually on sale at lord and taylor when i last looked they were 10 percent off so that's also a good price I'll, I'll link it below if i can find where else they're on sale so that is my new mark jacobs traveler tote in the small size um, if I end up getting the beige one or any of the large ones in any color, I will definitely follow up with a, a comparison, but I really like the small size. This is just, just a great everyday casual crossbody bag um, with the option to turn into just a tote bag. But uh, yeah, so, <laughs> you know, it's just a, a more casual version of a book tote, which is already pretty casual on its own. But yeah, so, so cute. I really like this color. This is the blue shadow color. Um, yeah, let me know. Let me know what you think of this. It's it's not for everyone. It's not everyone's style. This is just a lot more practical for me, I think. Let me know if you are considering getting this also and if you do, you know what colors you would pick. Thank you so much for watching and I hope to see you in my next video. Bye.